Stress plus essential oils obsessed. Ugh. No. Want to know how to get thousands of workouts or workout programs at your fingertips? Nah, bitch. 100%. Hello everyone, how are you doing today? I hope you are doing well. So today we are going to do some r slash anti MLM for fun. So stay tuned if that is something that you are interested in. Let's get into the cringe, guys. <laughs> Hello everyone, thanks so much for tuning in. My name is Beth or Queen of Spades. Please do give this video a like, subscribe if you're new here. Now without further ado, let's throw some spade. Legit, this is me right now. This is me right now, okay? This is me. Okay, so first and foremost, I just have to have a little talk with you guys for a minute. I have had the most exhausting week of my life. So here is what happened to our family. My daughter, well, not really what like happened to our family, but my daughter had her first tooth loose for a week this tooth would not come out of her mouth. And for a week, she felt the need to wake me up at least three times to six times a night in order to let me know it was still there. Because apparently, I needed to know that. And it, it was very cute, you know? It was like, oh, I know, sweetheart. Yeah, it's still there. I know. It'll come out soon. Then I gotta go put her back to bed. And then, you know, I come back into my room. And I'm one of those people where if I'm up for a few minutes, it takes me a while, you know, like half an hour, 40 minutes, go back to sleep. So I'll be lying here, you know, just about to fall asleep. Of course, of course. And then she comes back in. Mom. Mom. Yes, sweetheart. What is it? You're just in here. What? What is it? My tooth is still there. Okay, yes, we know. I have an idea. Why don't you tell me when it falls out? So, what happened was the night that I actually did a stream with YouTube Schizophrenic, so you can go and check that out. I believe I also shared it in my drama playlist. You can go take a look at it there. And... I'm, I'm trying to live stream <laughs> and what's going on is my daughter is waking up several times while I'm live streaming because that was the night that her tooth finally fell out. And so my husband's trying to put her back to bed. Of course we have like everything ready to go, you know, tooth fairy, whatnot. And She's just not falling asleep. She keeps waking up to check. And my husband's coming in. He's like, she's, she's like, she's like, you're on live stream and she's like not sleeping. Like, I need you to like try and hurry up. Like, we got to get this kid to bed. And I'm like, I know I just, I have to do this live stream. I should only be a few hours. Like, like she's going to fall asleep. Like, I don't know what to do. Uh, she's just super excited. Like, I don't know if she's going to fall asleep. Like, I don't know. So finally at the end of the live stream, you know, cause my husband came in a few times during it. Finally at the end of the live stream, she was sleeping. Everything went well. I go to go to bed. And, uh, of course my daughter, comes in a little while later to let me know that the tooth fairy came and then that entire night I was woken up to get told the tooth fairy came. I am exhausted. Exhausted right now. So tired. The tooth fairy finally came. Uh, yesterday I was just a zombie. Just out of it. And t today I'm, I'm kind of out of it too. So I do apologize. Wednesday there was no video because, uh, you know, I had my, I was, I've just been so exhausted all week. Okay. 
<laughs> and it was just like, I can't do it. Uh, my husband and I kind of had a fun night too, Tuesday. Uh, we, you know, so we were up late and then basically what happened is I was just exhausted. So I, I just needed a break. It was like, I'm sorry guys for the Wednesday video. I know I usually put up an extra one Wednesday, but my life has been exhausting, and that is enough rambling about that. I am so sorry. I just, I had to get that off my chest, because now I'm just relieved. The tooth is gone. She got 10 bucks. Happy kid. Last night, I got some sleep, but I'm, I'm still so tired today. <laughs> Like, I'm just like, oh my god, I need to sleep for like three nights really well, and then I'll be good to go. So, next week should be a better week, and without further ado, since I'm a rambling mess right now, let's just get on to our r slash anti-MLM. So here we are at the r slash anti-MLM subreddit. It is my favorite one in the entire world. Let's start off right away with a shit post, because why not? Stay safe out there. Probability of contagion. So here we have very high, high, medium, low. If you stay six feet away, very low. And then, of course, we have, hey, hon, and we got none there. So just stay far away from the Huns. They're contagious. I am definitely the audience for this. Let's do it. When you're talking to a cute pop punk girl from Seattle on Insta and she turns out to be a boss bit. Oof, that's not very punk of her at all. <laughs> and here it is. I love this. This is great. <laughs> Boast Hun Manor. Blink Hun 82, Modern Boss Babe, Fallout Boss, 20 Hun Pilots, Taking Back Hun Day. And I want to hear yours in the comments below if you can think of the best Hun Bot band names. Put them down in the comments. I have decided that since uh, your girls kind of got some musical talent, uh, I would be doing some songs some anti-mlm songs i've been working with some people at doing that and it has been super fun getting back into music and whatnot so i am really pumped and i thought that this would be a really great leeway into that and if anyone out there in the youtube world is interested in collabing with me in the anti-mlm community for a song hit me up let me know my email is always available, or you can get a hold of me on Instagram, Facebook, and we can arrange it, because I would love to do, like, some, like, if anyone out there can sing, see, I can't sing, I can only rap, so that's my issue, uh, so I need a singer, so I would love to have some people come sing some, you know, choruses for me. I'll do the raps. We can make it really fun. We can make it really, you know, spunky. I think that the community needs it and we love this. So we, we don't love this though. This on the screen, we don't love. Look at that weight loss before, after, in only six weeks of drinking Fit T. Robert lost $500. That's exactly it. And we all know that they manipulate the pictures. So there's that. It isn't often that I see a hun use the no option, but when I do, I definitely seize the opportunity, don't we all? <laughs> if I went live and talked tomorrow about how Arbon can change your life, would you be interested? 25% yes, 75% no. I'm actually just surprised that 25% said yes. I've seen a lot of these where it's 100% no. Those ones always make me laugh. Love it. Oh no. Hey, Petal, the company is called Valentus, and it's all legit. If you want me to send you some facts with the company, I can do. It's all FDA approved. Kiss, kiss. Slim Rose Optimum contains the compound 2-amino-5 methyl heptane. This is the compound for 
Octodrine. Anything containing this ingredient is not for resale in the UK as it's an unapproved ingredient and according to the NSF comes with its risks if consumed. So not only is it an MLM, it's illegal in the UK. Really recommend reconsidering whether you want to be working for them, hon. I'll do some research into that, but thank you for making me aware of it, and I'll let you know what I decide to do. So please do give us an update and let us know if you saved this Hunbot. I would like to know. Good job, Petal. Eight years ago, I won a kit in a contest. Today, the Hun pops up out of nowhere to invite me to her Facebook group. She then accuses me of theft when I call out the MLM scam. And it's pure romance. See, nothing pure about it. Hope you're having a nice day today. It's Hunt T. When you have a chance, come join my business page. It's a private and confidential community for women only. Heart, today we started a huge sale. Let me know if you have questions. Present? Why? Unsubscribe. Okay, I took the risk to message you thinking by now your heart had found forgiveness for whatever you hated me for. Sorry, smarty. Oh, this isn't a copy-pasted message. I don't hate you. Just know that MLMs like pure romance are predatory and I want nothing to do with them. Not interested in being one of the 94% of consultants who earn less than $500 a year. I'm not a predatory, neither is the business I run for which feeds my kids. I bought you your kit. See Pure Romance's own income disclosure statement, and buying my kit is a part of what makes it predatory. You spend money, not sell product, and recruit other people to level up. You make your effort. When I bought you your kit, you didn't put in any. I only invited you to my page. That's called a pyramid scheme. My encounter with you is what opened my eyes. Not interested. Not in shopping and not in luring other women in to make an average of $101 a year. I don't earn based on what my team does. I earn based on efforts. Did you like the kit I bought you? I think you enjoyed the toys, which is why I invited you to my community. I'm not asking you to buy a kit. I'm not going to engage with a predatory company. In fact, I warn people away from buying from Pure Romance, and I'm a sex therapist, so I warn a lot of people. I like this sex therapist. This is exactly the sex therapist I would go to. Not that I need to, but I'm just saying. You remember how I, you begged me to buy you one after my husband lost his job? You never paid me back. Who scammed who? That meeting you took me to was creepy and cult-like. Made me do my research. I refuse to support any MLM. You can delete my number. It's not an MLM. It's direct selling. You stole from me. You're the only scam. Pay my back. It's time. You held a contest on Facebook to give away a kit. I owe you nothing. And for someone talking about hate, you're being really nasty. You stole from me. $250 kit, remember? <laughs> It wasn't a contest. You're a therapist. Last time you contacted me was 2016. You tried to sell me stuff. Certainly didn't level accusations at me then. Seems to me that if this were true, you would have mentioned it four years ago. That's true. Now, block, delete, Hunty is crazy. And thank God you did not join onto her team and... I am very happy that as a sex therapist, you do warn a lot of people from using predatory companies like Pure Romance. Go. You go. Do it. That was so satisfying. Me. Chemicals are bad. Let's clean with lemons and flower petals and thieves. Also me. I don't give a fuck what's in it. I will drink my coffee creamer until the day I die. I love love how they called it thieves. 
the irony is just beautiful to me. Oh, Lord. So here we have Coffee, Jesus, and Mary Kay. Now, here's the thing. I myself am atheist. I do not believe in any of these. Like, I don't believe in religion. I don't believe in spirituality stuff. I don't believe in crystals. I don't believe in mythology being real. I don't believe in, um, you know, like, uh, people having demons that do crimes for them. I don't believe in things like this. And I'm atheist. However, I do have several friends of mine who are Christian. And one of their major complaints with these MLM companies as Christians is the fact that religion is often used as a manipulation tactic. I recently did a video on this exact thing, which... I hope that in my video as an atheist, I wasn't throwing any spade towards religion. If I did offend anyone, I'm very sorry. That wasn't my intent. My intent wasn't to judge religion at all. It was to judge the hunty hunbots who use it against people that are religious. And I have an issue with that. I don't think that even as an atheist, I have an issue with people using religion to manipulate other people that are religious, right? Like it's one of my big issues with religion to begin with. Anyway, so when I see something like coffee, Jesus, and Mary Kay, I go, oh God, here's another one. So let's take a little look-see. I and every other mother that is out of a job would appreciate you not to push us down under your feet. And you are the very first person to comment on my brand new business, stress, and extreme fear. I have poured so much into this. You feel like a man doing this? I am a direct seller. And if you are not interested or against something, Something. Just move on. Love, the stage 2B cancer patient whose new business you tried to destroy before it launches. Really? Oh my god, that was one of the most cringiest things I have ever read in my life. Ever. Like, oh god. I recommend you get out of this business immediately. Watch John Oliver's takedown of MLMs or watch the documentary about Herbalife betting on zero. Here's an article that will educate you too. You will not make money doing this and you will most likely ostracize family and friends. Drop of a link. And of course, it is one of my favorite articles ever actually, which is thinking of joining an MLM, read the truth behind income opportunity. Yeah, and it's from the Talented Ladies Club. I believe we've read articles from them before. I love that. So, uh, <laughs> she's like trying to guilt trip this person with her cancer and trying to be all like, I'm a stage 2B cancer patient who new business you're trying to destroy and I'm just trying to do Mary Kay but it's like but you're using Mary Kay and Jesus to manipulate other people so it's just all <laughs> ugh, cringe gross I hate it oh my god this has cured my boredom tonight got terrorized to sell perfumes and then when I finally said yes they added me to a group chat where they were slagging me off pissing myself my reply got me kicked out, though. <laughs> Alrighty, let's take a little look. Never known it so hard. She's asking all sorts. Forward me the messages. I've got ans an answer for everything. Oh my god, here it goes. She's a beautician. So, for example, if I sell something at 16 pounds, what do I get? Wish I never started talking to her. Oh my god, says Chloe. Jessica says, tell her. Like I said, each product comes with different points and profits. I'll give you an example. Our fragrances, you earn four pounds on pures and seven pounds on pure royals. This is just fragrances. They are one product we sell out of hundreds available. You also get amazing incentives. 
feel like saying, you know what, don't bother. She could be a diamond in the making. If she's a beautician, she will be off work at the moment with potential loads of customers still wanting beauty products. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. She put on Facebook asking if there was others around, so I messaged her. Brill. So I got a reply of, okay, show me. Okay, okay. All that, and I get that. Rude. Just put, we'll leave it with you and let me know if you want to sign up. Oh my god, Emma, you actually forwarded the message if she sells? Didn't mean to. Don't think she paid attention. She's a bit rude, right? What do I need again to sign her up? Takes five minutes to sign you up, hon. I just need your full address, date of birth, mobile number, and email address, please. Multitasking here. Get her signed up, Lauren. Everything in here you need. All these girls are lovely and will help you out. Welcome to the team, hon. Hi, girls. Black-haired Barbie here, who could possibly be a diamond in the making with lots of clients still wanting beauty products. I bet you really wish you didn't bother with me now. If any of you need any tips on how to run a successful business, which I think you do, slagging new member of the team off, then please drop me a message. But for now, I think I'll leave this amazing opportunity as I don't think I'm going to fit in. <laughs> And they removed her from the group. And that, ladies and gentlemen, was an insight into how they uh, talk about signing you up and how they plan what to say to you. Oh, that was a beautiful, beautiful insight. Oh, no. Grandma! Grandma! Don't sell your pearls! Oh, wait, it's probably paparazzi. Yep. Oh, well, sorry, Grandma. Rest in peace. Motivation is a mind control technique. Every MLM company uses it. Yes, truth. Exciting news! I am so excited to announce I am now a Rodent and Fields independent consultant. And I know what you are thinking, so let's see the record straight. Let's just set it straight right now. Here's what it won't be. Me being that girl that you have to block from sliding into your DMs with, Hey girl, a pyramid scheme. Me trying to convince you of anything. Here's what it will be, me sharing my results and experiences with the number one skincare company in North America. Doubt it. Why the fuck are you selling Arbon? Because I like the products and need to make more money. Why aren't you selling Arbon? Well, one, I don't think I'm old enough. Two, it's a pyramid scheme. If that's the case, then literally every business is a pyramid scheme. Also, I have like zero costs for it and do not have to hold on to any inventory. Which pyramid schemes are the exact opposite? But when you are old enough, I will be happy to get you set up. I will bring you some samples when I come over next. Oh, please no. I'm so sorry if she did. I hope you threw them out right in front of her. Thieves! Why are we still bathing ourselves in chemicals that are known endocrine disruptors contributing to fertility issues, weight issues, depression and cancer, damaging to our central nervous systems, and actually contributing to respiratory issues? Let's stop overloading our bodies with toxins and start ridding our homes of things we can actually control! Hashtag be the gatekeeper! Thieves household cleaner is the only thing we've used to clean our house over the last two plus years. Literally every single thing in our house. Tables, floors, kitchen, counters, sinks, toilets, showers, windows, mirrors, toys, everything. I will forever and always share this plant-based goodness with everyone I know because it is safe, effective, and it's been hands down the best and easiest change we've made for our family's health. Yesterday, Young Living announced the new Thieves Starters Kit that's better than ever and has dropped in price from $160 to only $125. <gasps> what? The new Thieves Starter Kit comes with two bottles of Thieves Cleaner. These will last you a couple of years and whatever else it comes with, we don't care because we're not getting it. Because they steal your money like every MLM does. Run! Stress plus essential oils obsessed. Eh, no. 
My Mother's Day nails. So cute at Color Street. Oh man, they're they're like chipped. They the Oh Lord, what is this? Like that we got a piece missing here. What is this going on here? We got like a hangnail piece. They're crooked. Uh, it, it, it looks awful. And let's just say this is this is ugly. Okay, I'm sorry, but it is. Want to know how to get thousands of workouts or workout programs at your fingertips? Nah, bitch, 100%. Here is an Arbon Hun that is sending voice messages. I want to talk about the voice messages from a mo for a moment. So when I was doing It Works, they always told us to talk to everyone in voice messages because you have to talk to everyone like they are your best friend. And also people feel like you're being more personal with them when they hear your voice. It's easier to convince people when they hear your voice than it is with just messages. So apparently Arbonne is on to doing the same thing and many other MLM companies are. So if you're wondering why you get voice messages from the Hunbots, that is why they are trying to trick you into thinking that they're being more personal, care about you more, and that they are an actual friend. You know better. Don't fall for it. If you want Herbalife products, please DM me or WhatsApp. Skin, hair, body, delivery straight to your home. Hashtag extend lockdown. Hashtag COVID-19. So here we got Hunty using COVID again. I hate how they are doing this. Stop using COVID. How many times do we and the FTC have to tell you stop it? Oh no! Tanya! Run away from Amway Europe! Run, girl! Run! Hey, girl! I came across your page. Great job on your fitness journey. Thank you. It's hard, but I'm doing it. Respect, girl heart. How long have you been doing it? Losing weight? It's been a struggle for many years, but a month of forking out and eating better. Whoa, great choice. Maybe I can help you. I'm looking for new clients. I want to change your lifestyle forever. Your mental health, physical, body, and eating habits. I'm good. I am good. Don't do it. Don't sign up for them. Herbalife is a train wreck. Goodbye, hunty. So this is a Google form for a work from home application. Yeah, they're a uh, Trying to do everything they can. Let's see what it says. I think this will be the last one we go through today. Let's see. Hiya! I am so excited for you. My name is Allison. If you've come across this application, I'm sure you have a little idea of what I do. For the past 2.5 years, I've been working from social media, and what brought me here was my desire for more. Before I started this journey in social media, I was teaching middle school and coaching three sports. My son was only two, and my husband was starting a new career as a fishing guide. We were barely making enough money to pay our bills, even though we were constantly working. I was exhausted and missed my family so much. I had so many responsibilities, so many people depended on me, but I just wanted to be home with my boys. Plus, we weren't making enough to do the things that we really wanted. I knew there had to be more and that life was not meant to struggle. Long story short short, this opportunity fell into my lap, and here I am almost three years later. I have been able to get all our bills on auto draft. We have paid off so much debt. I quit coaching and am home so much more. I am excited to teach every day and am driven to do more. I am surrounded by the most encouraging and ambitious women who lift each other up and I have the ability to do more for my family. And most importantly, we are so much freer than before. I still teach sixth grade. That is my passion. But now I control my income. I control what we can do. I control my goals and my success. I am in control of my life and I couldn't imagine it any other way. If you're anything like me, you don't want to spend the rest of your life working for the bare minimum. 
you deserve more. Or maybe you don't like your current job and want a way another way to make a full-time income. Or even most recently, you might have lost your job and needing an income. If you dream big, you can have everything you desire. Your life is yours, and I'm here to help you reach your dream life. Before you fill out this application, I want you to know some of the things you'll learn when you join me. How to make an income from social media, the steps to work from home daily, how to make make social media stories, like make make them, you know, not just make them, make make, how to take creative photos, how to grow your network, plus so much more. We will help you transform your social media into a professional brand that personally fits you. Plus, then we show you how it can make you an income. So ask yourself these questions. Are you goal-oriented? Are you coachable? Work hard, play hard mentality? Are you ready to hustle plus change your life? Are you open-minded? Like open-minded enough for a pyramid scheme? Now let's take this opportunity and turn passion and desire into an income plus a life you love. If you're ready to change your entire life, apply below and let's see if this opportunity is right for you. Ugh. Oh, Allison. Allison, Allison, Allison. I highly doubt anyone is applying. I highly doubt it. And I hope that you get out. And did you also use COVID and people being out of work? Gosh, I hate that. Anyway, guys, I think I'm going to end the video there. I hope that you enjoyed my dumpster fire of a last minute put together anti-MLM video for you all because... You know, my whole week has been exhausting, and I hope you are all having a much better week than I am. We're all going to get through this parenting with COVID thing together and being in quarantine. I swear we are. We, we have to. So I hope that you're having a better week than I am, and no matter where you are, no matter what you're doing, I hope that you're all having a fabulous day. Give the video a like, subscribe if you're new, share it to some hunt bots, maybe you'll save them, who knows, it's worth a shot, right? And basically, until the next time, take care guys, bye!